reagent you can see the ch3 mgbr is the grignard reagent react with the water is give the alkane if you have the grignard reagent react with d2o you will get the ch3d if you have grignard reagent react with acid you will get the alkanes if you have the grignard reagent it with react with the epoxide you will get this products and if you have the grignard reagent it with react with methyl cyanide and you will get this ketones if you have Alka uh, methyl magnesium bromide it react with the acet uh, acetylene uh, yeah, or alka alkyne you will get this uh, butane to wine all yeah, methyl um, grignard reagent react with this uh, 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 ester you will get this third al um, three degree alcohol yeah, um, grignard reagent react with the phenol you will get this uh, methyl magnesium um, phenoxide uh, and alkane if you have the Grignard reagent it react with the ester you will get the ketones and finally benzylic 3 degree alcohol if you have this uh, uh, ch3 co ch2 ch2 br uh, reacts with magnesium ether you will get this uh, Grignard reagent it undergo reaction with intramolecular you will get this cyclized product if you have the ethyl chloroformate uh, living group capacity cl greater than ethoxide uh, you will get this uh, ester and this ester react with the Grignard reagent you will get the ketone and this ketone react with the uh, Grignard reagent you will get this product and finally 3 degree alcohol and NAR means ring opening of epoxide and due to steric rounding you will get this product now you can see the um, um, formation of uh, Grignard reagent and react with the water you will get the alkanes and react with the C2H5OH, you will get the alkanes and Zwitter ion methods. If you have this Br magnesium bromide Grignard reagent, and finally you will get the cyclohexane. If you have the active hydrogen estimation H plus Grignard reagent, react with the H, uh, acetylene or alkyne hydrogen, you will get the alkanes. If you have the this compound, you will make the Grignard reagent, and finally you will get the benzenes. And CS3 react with the magnesium, you will get the methyl magnesium bromide. React with the D2O, you will get these products. If you have the cyclohexene type reaction, it will give the uh, meth uh, cyclohexene magnesium bromide. If you have the one mole of oxalic acid, you will get the methane and the their products. Now you say can see the Grignard reagent nucleophile or base uh, RMGX uh, formations of in presence of dry ether formation of methyl magnesium bromide and if you react with the formaldehyde you will get the primary alcohol if you react with acetaldehyde you will get the tertiary secondary alcohol if you react with the acetone you will get the tertiary alcohol if you react with the carbon dioxide you will get the acetic acid and equilophilic addition reactions.